<sighs> the May 2015 JW broadcast. The gift that just keeps on giving. Yeah. We want to thank George Miller for sending us the link to this music video. Yeah, because when we watched it, um, Kim and I recognized it right off the bat. We just went ballistic. And George Miller uh, sent the video also to Janet Mira. Janet and Jim Mira. And she confirmed that this was the view from their house. Yes. So we're, we're going to assume that most of you have not seen our Rio Rancho interview with the Mira family. And we'll post the link to those videos down below. And also the link to the KRQE because they the went out there report. and interviewed them also. So hopefully we can get the timeline here so right. So we'll give a little bit of background information. And um, forgive me if I interrupt Kim because... Actually, we his, oh, his this has been very difficult. Here's a true confession. This is take number three, <laughs> and trust me, takes one and two is not going to be on the outtakes. <laughs> uh uh, no way. <laughs> so anyhow, no, can't even put those in the outtakes. No, so we're going to try to work on this together. This is take three, right? Take three or four, whatever it is. Um, okay. So what happened is Jim is confined to a wheelchair and his one joy in life was sitting out on their porch or looking out his dining room window right. at the Sandia Mountains and for Balloon Fiesta to see all the balloons going yeah, up. Yeah, so what you saw in that clip was the view that the Rio Rancho Kingdom Hall of Jehovah's Witnesses stole from yeah. Jim. And what makes us so angry is this clip in the video is like an F you to the Mira family and to us and all those who are working so hard to fight, you know, this Kingdom Hall from blocking their view. Um, well, Kim and I even contacted our state governor to yeah. see if there was anything that she could possibly do. Yeah, and I mean, we were contacting city officials, we were writing letters, we were making phone calls. I mean, we were just contact city councilmen. I mean, it was just unbelievable and so much support, you know, from the XGW community on Facebook. And from uh, JW Piss State, you know, brother, uh, collectively, I'm guessing we sent out over two, three hundred of those uh, yellow jacket stingers, you know, not, yeah. you know, from not in my town. So, I mean, there was really a concentrated effort on a lot of people's part to do what we could to prevent this from happening. Yes. And the biggest thing is that when they met with the RBC and the brothers who were building this Kingdom Hall and asked them not to, you know, block the view because it's a big piece of land and you'll yeah. see from the aerial photos and they had plenty of room to just move it over and at least give him his dining room window view. And you also see it in our Rio Rancho yeah. uh, videos also. And they just stubbornly, stubbornly lied, you know, to this poor family. And Elder Trevor shook their hand and says, oh, yeah, yeah oh, yeah, it's doable. So if you're not a Jehovah's Witness and you happen to see this video, when you're shaking the hand in agreement with the Jehovah Witness, know that they're going to lie right to your face. Because that's what Trevor Wiseman did. And, and he's an elder in this congregation. So while he was making a, a handshake agreement, a verbal agreement with his neighbor, he knew all along yeah. and that what, he was going to lie. And what is so disturbing, like we said, there was plenty of room on this plot of land to move the Kingdom Hall, put it anywhere else. They told the Mira family, oh, you know, because of the spark, uh, parking spaces, you know, we needed three more parking spaces. So, yeah, they didn't need three more parking spaces. You know, you, you screwed this family over just for three lousy parking three spaces. Three parking spaces. You're an asshole. Yeah. You know, and when you see this video, they're proudly displaying this beautiful view and cleaning up the yard of the Kingdom Hall in this clip. Yeah, how do you think the Mira family felt when they watched this video? It made them sick. And trust me, Watchtower and Trevor, they saw the clip. Yeah, they did. In fact, we've post they've posted it. Um, there is a Facebook page called Save Jim's View, and we've been posting all of this on there. And in fact, as soon as this video is done, that is going on there. And we're going to plaster it everywhere to show how Watchtower is just a bunch of liars, and they don't care about people. They don't people. care. So if you're again, if you're not a Jehovah's Witness and you happen to see this video, 
know that when these people come knocking on your door, you know, telling you the, the good news of the kingdom, they tell you they're doing this because they love God and they love their neighbors. They're looking at you right straight in the eyes and they're lying to you. Yes, and you might be able to see from our video and our original videos, but the view they're showing, you know, and this east wall, if you would have turned it, if we had Google Earth, yeah, if we you actually could turn, tried to Google Earth it to turn. Yeah, the but view I don't around. have the exact address. But if you would to turn it around and look straight on at the Kingdom Hall that is looking directly at the mountains, you might be able to see a little bit of the Mura's front porch roof. Well, if I remember correctly, when we did that original interview video, didn't you walk down yeah. to the entrance of the Kingdom Hall driveway and took some? Yeah took a view from there to the Mira's house and you could see yeah. plain as day that that Kingdom Hall blocked their view. So if you go watch our original video, like I said, we're going to post it down below, you will see that I have the video camera and I actually showed how they completely blocked this family. And what's disturbing also is the Kingdom Hall isn't even that far away from their wall. I mean, no, there's I... only like 15 or 20 feet. Yeah. So... If you're a non-Jehovah Witness, um, again, do not trust these people with anything because they're, they're a bunch of liars and thieves. One will lie and the other one, by God, will swear to it. Yeah. So our hearts go out to the Mira family. Again. And like I said, you know, I just wish there was so, you know, something we could do to help them. And it just breaks our heart, you know, to see this blatant, you know, hope. Oh, so proud look at our beautiful view yeah you don't deserve that view exactly so sorry for the rant guys but we just had to get this off our chest and sorry it took three takes <laughs> four takes whatever oh man i need a drink after that yes. one